Thanks for being back up here today. We're enjoying. Uh, I thought it was a great game. I thought Tennessee found a way to win, and uh, you know they fought, fought through a lot of adversity. So that was good to see. You got to spend all day on campus. What else did you get to do besides just just attend the game? Like talk with coaches before or anything? Uh, yeah, I got here last night, and today I kind of just uh, hung out. Uh, visit started about twelve thirty, kind of with all the other groups. So. What was that time like with the coaches? How, how does that relationship continue to grow? Uh, it's going good. Uh, I know I like all the coaches. You know, it's a very it, they have a lot of guys here to support the quarterback. So I think that's a uh, definitely an added plus. Uh, on, you know, thinking about um, schools, uh, options, schools, stuff like that. So. Uh, take me through what you saw from the offense today. You know, obviously a day where they had to run the football a little bit more. What stood out about that? Yeah, I thought they ran the ball really well. I think I got three guys who can do the job, and you know they rotate them well. And uh, you know they move the ball quite a bit. You know, they couldn't really finish in the red zone, but uh, they moved the ball really well, so that was encouraging. And uh, did it down a couple receivers. So, what, what have you been to games here before? But see if you have the atmosphere, any of that stuff, kind of catch your attention. I guess seeing Checker kneeling in person and all that. Yeah, I've I've actually I visited a lot, but that was on my second game, and yeah. uh, that was my first time seeing a checker. So yeah, the atmosphere is crazy again. Um, what were the conversations with the coaches like? You know, you guys talk to the football, was it just kind of catching up, saying hey, that kind of stuff? Yeah, you know, it's probably more a uh, casual visit. Um, you know, I think they're definitely showing me that I'm a priority and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, at the end of the day, you know, they've been very consistent throughout this. And, I, you know, I don't expect them to change their personality or anything for, for recruits. So. When you say they're making you feel like a priority, is that just the way they communicate so consistently? I mean, how, how are they doing that? Um, yeah, just kind of Coach Abel coming to games, you know, talking to them a lot, um, you know, being here. Uh, just, you know, I feel like everybody made, me, made it feel like home for me, so it was good. Talk, talk to any other, other recruits or any, any commits here that were like, working yeah. on you or anything? Yeah, I talked to a lot of Lipscomb kids. Uh, they're all here. You know, my teammate Colby Harmon's here, Shavar's here, both teammates. Uh, sat next to uh, uh, Ross, the 24 DM yeah. commit. Yeah, he's, he's a good dude. And, uh, you know, I know you'll have two corners committed already in 25, so. At 25 class off to a good start. So. And, uh, and you'll be, will you be back here for the Georgia game next month? Did you know yet? Uh, I want to be, so we'll see. Yes, sir. It depends on kind of what we're doing uh, at VA and stuff like that. So we'll probably be in the playoffs, so we'll see. What's next for you on the visit front? I'll be uh, two weeks from now, I'll be at UCLA when they play Colorado. Is that the only one you've got scheduled right now? Yes. Yeah. You, you've released yeah. your top schools. You know, how is the process kind of started? Yeah. Hard to speed up a little bit for you. I mean, where do you feel like you're at? In it? Uh, probably. I feel like a lot of people know that's a pivotal moment. You know, it's kind of end of my junior season. Um, so yeah, definitely trying to uh, choose wisely with my game day visits because I don't know how many more I'll have. You know, coming next year. So um, yeah. Do you have a working timeline in mind for when you want to knock this decision out? Or um, where are you at with that? One? I wouldn't say I have a timeline, but if I if I feel like I, I know a place is home and I. You know, I wouldn't hesitate to pull the trigger. So I don't know if I have a date I feel like I have to be committed by or a date where I feel like I need to. So. Last thing for me, what have you thought of Tennessee's season overall, just kind of how they, not just today, just how they played overall and kind of building on that season? Yeah, at the end of the day, you know, I feel like they only have one loss, right? So, uh, you know, they're, they're finding a way to win in many different ways. And uh, last year, the explosive offense, you know, they lost a lot of guys from it, and it's just, that's just the truth. But, you know, they find ways to win, and, uh, you know, their coaching staff's really good.